everyone today is death wish coffee mail day that's right this came today the mail was early i'm so glad i was really looking forward to this and the box does seem lighter but i'm not mad at that so let's open this puppy up So it kind of looks like my mail is coming in a specific order. So today is Death Wish Coffee Mail. Um, then tomorrow is Simply Good Mail from Sun City Subs and Candles. So, you know, tomorrow again I'll leave my affiliated um, code for you to get 20% off your entire purchase from Sin City Soaps and Candles, just like I always do. Which, as you should all know by now, is Shars Nation 10, all in caps. We, um, I shouldn't do that with those sewing scissors. Ooh, my five pound baby. Oh. Five pounds of coffee. Oh my gosh, that smells so good. Five pounds, my friend. Now they have this like cute little clip thing on here. This. But I haven't been using it to clip the coffee shut. And then again, a sticker. Sticker, sticker. I love these stickers. I have a collection of them. <laughs> oh. But I like these because eventually I will end up using these for something else. But five pounds of whole bean goodness. I really have to give some props to Death Wish Coffee. And considering you guys already know I have epilepsy, um, their brand has helped my epilepsy headaches so good that when I wake up with that really bad epilepsy headache and I go in the kitchen, and <laughs> you guys are going to be like, you're hugging that like it's a baby. Yeah. Well, this is my five pounds of Death Wish Coffee, baby. This thing will last me three months. Five pounds last me three months. No joke. Depends on how much you're actually putting in your coffee grinder. Or if you just happen to get... I get the whole bean. I love grinding the beans fresh. That's just me. Um, but, oh my goodness. That's my mail for today. Tomorrow is Sun City Sips and Candles, like I said. And then Monday is my, um, my Slay Glam. And then Tuesday is... A package from Beautylish, which is all three of the Jeffree Star blood palettes. I will not only swatch those, but I plan on doing a look probably with a combination of stuff from all three palettes. Um, so you can look forward to that. Uh, I almost collapsed last night. I'm not going to lie to you guys. I almost collapsed last night. Um, so I'm kind of having to take it easy. As you guys know, I've been working on the dress. And I was on video call with my friend. And oh, I forgot, she's just over my shoulder. And over here on the desk, I have the bodice. With the Death Wish coffee sticker right there on my machine. See that? Right there on my machine. Death Wish. 
it made it onto my sewing machine because it's that good. <laughs> anyway, yeah, they are. And I like my little uh, iron. That's not bad. I'm glad I saw that on with Wendy. Um, absolutely. Here's the thing. When you're working on stuff, do not take too much time, especially with my spinal condition. Don't take too much time sitting like that. Oh my gosh, you're going to really hurt yourself doing that. Um, so remember to take care of your health. Your health is very important. And I'm not talking about this bedauchery of whatever that's going around. I'm talking about the reality of what it is. Um, and like I've said in other videos, remember when people would get the chicken pox and we were all trying to be exposed to the chicken pox to get it? I had the chicken pox when I was a teenager and it was not, it was not lovely. It was so not lovely. Um, physically broke out from the top of my head all the way down to the bottom of my feet when I had the chicken pox in places you don't want them. Um, so, yeah. Yeah, definitely take care of your health. Your health is really important. So let's say you go outside, you need to breathe some fresh air. Uh, look, everybody needs to go outside and breathe all at once. Maybe we need to do the scheduled world goes outside and breathes all at once kind of thing. You're like, are you making a movement? Absolutely. I don't know, maybe. Um, I think we all need to go outside and breathe. Uh, go get yourself some fresh air in your lungs. Please. It doesn't... Breathing stale air does not help the lung. Uh, my friend Rocco's mom barely went outside in her old age. And um, it did, it helps to suppress the vascular, the cardiovascular and the upper respiratory. And we, none of us need that. So go outside and get some fresh air. I don't care if you sit on a porch, stand outside for a few minutes, if you can stand. If you're in a wheelchair, wheel yourself outside, or if you need assistance, have somebody bring you out. Get some fresh air. Okay, so as soon as I'm done with the dress, I'm going to... I'm going to switch things up. Just a poquito. Um, just take a break from my machine for a little while. And switch a few things up. We have beauty content coming. Um, I'm going to teach you. You know, I have that other wooden tray, the plain one. And what what I'm going to do with that one, and this is what I've decided to do with it, is I'm going to teach you guys how to do a Bob Ross style painting on a wooden tray. Yeah, that's right. You heard me. A Bob Ross style painting on a wooden tray on the inside of it. Um, it's home decor. Um, I want everybody to understand you can have exquisite looking home decor that you see in the stores. Taught to you by huh? And there's another channel on YouTube that shows you how you can take specific things if you're in a rental, right? And it doesn't break any rental thing. Um, and make your home fan, fantabulous, you know, for you, for your style and how you can do it and 
glam place up at barely any cost. So, uh, yeah, that, that'll be awesome. So, I did take my medicine today, my friend that I live with. See, now this is why I can't live alone. My friend that I live with, um, got upset with me because I hadn't taken my medicine in three months. I know. Like, what? 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 You better start taking it. Okay, alright, alright. I did, I promise. Otherwise, this wouldn't be undone like that. This is a preventative for my epilepsy. Okay. Um. This is the Topamate. And I did take my thyroid medication today. I got something else. I just like, I'm so tired of pills. Okay, here's my thyroid pills. So I did at least take those three. It's helping me feel a little bit better. A little lot better. I just have to get back in the swing of it. So I have to take these two again tonight. Um. I promise, I promise, Templar Knights, <laughs> I promise, um, that I will get back into, like, taking it like I'm supposed to, um, <laughs> I'm supposed to be taking a water pill and potassium every day, but I don't like taking that. And I think that's part of, like, irrational happenings going on. Now, I have one other epilepsy pill I'm supposed to be taking, but actually I think that one caused a rash around my neck last time. So I'm not going to take that one. The other two that I just took, along with drinking two cups of death wish coffee in my cauldron. <laughs> poison for the children. No, it's not poison. If you have a child that has epilepsy, I know doctors and nurses say, don't do it, don't do it. Or you have a child that's, you know, overexcited, you know, Everybody says that those kids are ADHD. No, they're normal kids. Kids are kids. Uh, give them a cup of coffee if you have a hyperactive child. Um, just like that. They calm down. So anyway, um, we did our death wish coffee. And, uh box today. I was so excited. I was tracking it. I checked my email and it said it was in transit. I really have, like I said, I really have to give props to Death Wish. You guys are awesome. Thank you very much for helping my epilepsy. Um, all my three months worth of coffee, everyone. Uh, my my plans for this five pound bag is to get an air seal container, pour it in there, slap some Death Wish stickers on the container. <laughs> That's right. Um, and for that, I want everybody to stay happy, stay healthy, stay positive, and as always, stay blessed because one thing may happen on one day where you feel down, and the next day, boom. You bounce right back. So I will see all of you in the next one. That might be a sewing show. Yay! Let's hope I'm done with this dress. <laughs> At least today, right? Alright, see you later.